As a parent, nothing feels more helpless than watching your child struggle with unexplained symptoms like dizziness, fatigue, rapid heartbeat, fainting, and just this relentless anxiety. Every time they stand up, your heart races along with theirs, wondering if they'll feel faint or collapse. You've probably heard that POTS or postural orthostatic tachycardia syndrome is genetic or it's just one of those things. But deep down, you know that there has to be more to the story. For teens and for young adults, particularly girls, POTS can feel like a complete life disruption. But what if there's a root cause that's been overlooked? What if the answer lies in the one system of the body that connects it all together, the nervous system? In today's world, stress is everywhere. Between the academic pressures, social challenges, and that ever-present noise of technology, our kids' nervous systems are under this constant bombardment. This relentless stress often leaves their autonomic nervous system, the part that controls things like heart rate, blood pressure, and digestion, stuck in overdrive. And it's like that fight or flight switch has been jammed in the on position. This imbalance doesn't just happen randomly. For many people, it starts with the vagus nerve. It's a vital nerve that helps to regulate, calm, and balance the body. And when that vagus nerve becomes overstressed and worn down, it struggles to do its job. And when that happens, conditions like POTS can emerge, causing the very symptoms that disrupt your child's life. What's even more surprising is how the physical body ties into the equation. Think about your child's posture. Do they carry tension in their neck, in their shoulders, or their low back? Do they always end up in this slouched forward, exhausted position? That tension is a sign of what we call subluxation, which interferes with the nervous system's ability to function properly. And when subluxation impacts that vagus nerve particularly, as it travels through the neck and the spine, it disrupts the communication between the brain and the body. And this interference can cause a cascade of problems across many different systems, affecting heart rate, breathing, digestion, everything. POTS at its core is a disorder of the autonomic nervous system and it thrives in that state of dysregulation. Over time, chronic subluxation and nervous system dysregulation lead to a condition called dysautonomia and this occurs when the balance between the sympathetic or the fight or flight side and the parasympathetic rest relax regulate side is completely thrown off. So for many teens with POTS, their sympathetic system is stuck in overdrive while the calming, parasympathetic tone of the vagus nerve is barely functioning. And this imbalance explains why your child's body can't seem to find its footing, why they feel faint, anxious, and exhausted all at the same time. But there's hope. Here at Foundations, we specialize in uncovering the root causes of nervous system dysfunction using advanced diagnostic tools like our insight scans. We can then pinpoint areas of subluxation, measure autonomic nervous system function, and then identify the presence of dysautonomia. These scans, including neurothermal imaging and heart rate variability, provide some real measurable insights into what's wrong. They track progress over time, giving you hope and a path forward. So you don't have to accept POTS as a lifelong struggle for your child. By addressing the nervous system, restoring balance to that vagus nerve, and calming the chaos within, we can help your teen move forward towards a life of greater energy, calm, and confidence. So parents, take that first step in truly understanding what's behind your child's challenges. Reach out to foundations to learn more about how neurologically focused chiropractic care can help calm that storm and help your child to thrive once again.